I always wanted to work in an aged care ever since I was little because I grew up with my grandparents and then I always had a respect with them. And when I moved to Australia in 2009, uh, then I started working as a care staff in aged care. And during that time, I got more inspired. And I'm really passionate about elderly. I just love being with the old people and care for them and make a difference in elderly lives and also support the staff members. I did my university back in 2012 from the Ulongang University. I always wanted to be in aged care because I truly felt like it's an industry where nurses need to be. The reason I joined the BOPA was referral from one of my friends. I did research a little bit about BOPA and I was really amazed, you know, during that time, the largest provider in HK and not only the HK, the services BOPA are doing in healthcare, optical, dental, everywhere. 2013, I started as a registered nurse and I was just casual at that time. And then 2015, actually one of the care managers, she saw my potential and she offered me, would you like to do the acting clinical care manager? And then I was a bit amazed because I was just a casual, but how they identify my knowledge was really amazing. So I did the acting clinical care manager and then uh, I was permanent enrolled in 2016. And since 2019, uh, I'm permanent enrolled as a general manager. I'm overall accountable for every aspect of the home, like staffing, quality of care, residents, complaint management, home's financial status. I'm truly supported by Bupa during my career progression because I never believed on myself, you know. I never thought that I'm going to do the leadership role because I was more clinical, but Bupa did support me through all of my journeys. Just to see my residents happy, and team members happy. You know, when I walk into the door, uh, usually I do my round in the morning and to able to see a smile on my team members' face and then residents' face. I think that's the most exciting things to go to work.